of Food Love Productions, and I am really humbled and very proud to sit here as we bring this performance to you today. I'm Javon Brower, founding artistic director of Urban Bushwomen, and we are here in full circle at the Contemporary Art Center. In 1989, there was a vision of Urban Bushwomen being here for a long-term residency for three months, and that vision uh, was dreamed up with Urban Bushwomen and um, the artistic director, the founding artistic director of Jumba Productions, John O'Neill, and his managing partner at that time, James Porter, and M.K. Wegman, who was at the CAC, and uh, they made it happen. So in 1992, Urban Bushwomen spent uh, three months here moving from this idea of outreach to community engagement. And during that time, they forged this partnership that continues today. I'm really proud to say that I'm continuing a second generation of partnership with, with Urban Bushwomen. It's going back in lots of ways, and Cope for going back to before and remembering the civil rights movement and remembering those signs that people held saying, I am a man. And we take that with us as we move forward in this Black Lives Matter movement. Because what we know is the same song is being sung then that is being sung now. And that is seeing I am here, I am human, and I matter. Thank you. We are so honored to be here with all of you. Ancestor, breath, bridge, carry us over tumultuous times. You who can hear and answer with quick remedy, ready before we ask. You who can speak through tongues of trees and fire and water, earth cannot hold you. We pound the ground and you appear, O oh ancient ones. You who can make lightning strike with the flip of a skirt. You who can make tornado turn with the spin and span of hips take us there to the place of knowing, to the hall that leads to the doorway of you, O oh holy ones, you of the first light. You who know the potential of possibilities pulsing in the dark, deliver us unto our gifts. You who have sunlight in your fingertips, touch our drums, make us hear the rising, make us move a steady stump, a choir of voices so majestic, heaven hides us in a tapestry of light, we are stars, blankets of wonder, sky bright eyes seeing the invisible, visible. You who have returned, you have turned our faces so that we see ourselves and we have found you again in places we would have never imagined. You make our limits infinitely long our visions clearer with eyes closed and even there you still stand in full color vibrant and eager to serve
have a conversation about race.
which is universal of all human beings. It's not your fault, and it's not, it's not my fault that I write. It's not, and it's not my fault that I, that I write. It's not, it's not my fault that, I, that I'm doing something that I must do. I must do. What we might get at this evening is we are lucky, we are lucky, we are lucky. The mic doesn't fail, my voice holds out. We are lucky, we are lucky. Is what the importance of the afternoon.
Gather down and strengthen. Live it all in nice peace. Above the dirty bits of the world. All you did as you do. Stop taking dough. I quit thinking this is. Oh man, you know. Oh, this place is wrong, wrong. Says that he loves me, even though it's not his baby. Says he's gonna raise him up like he would his own son. Baby, this is a ring that's been worn by his mother. He takes me out dancing every day. Now I think about you. Each time I pass the filling station, cause of all the grease you used to wear in your <laughs> <laughs> And I still got that racket. Little Anthony at the Imperials. Uh, somebody stole my record player. How do you know my Sally, I almost went crazy. Then Mario got the fit. And I moved back to Omaha to live with my folks. Cause everyone, everyone, everyone I used to know is either dead or a prisoner. Came back to the river. This time I think I want to stay. Shall I think I'm happy? First time since my accident. And I wish I had all the money we used to spend on those. I'd buy me a used car lot. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't sell any of them. I just thrive. Different car every day. <laughs> Depending on how I feel. But God says, Tell me, if you want to know the truth, I don't have me no nothing. He don't play no trombone. And I need, I need, I need to borrow money. Hey. To pay the two lawyers, I'll be eligible for the room. Oh, man. I don't, I don't, I don't have me no, no husband. He don't play no children. And I need, I need, I need to borrow money, Charlie. Pay. To pay. This is your lawyer. I'll be eligible for the room. I'm bound. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mama. Mama girl. I missed you in class today. Bucks. 
can't you tell the steps? What would you do with that? Now all my children is coming on next, and I fully intend to watch it. I need something to calm my nerves after all the excitement we have had around here this morning. Yeah, you do. Mama Fair, did that lady really put the baby on the surprise? I just don't understand her. You did it, trust me. I wasn't talking about the crap. I was a man of hers. Yeah. They sitting up there getting high out of his mind on cocaine when he decided that he's going to leave her. Oh, then how did she love that man? She loved him with a hungry love. Oh, check this shit out. This is, this is what I heard happening. And this shit is too real. This is too real. I know what happened. Check this shit out, bitch. Oh, baby, we through. You're finished. Your ass is out. You ain't nothing but a drug addict, a dope fiend. And all I want out of this motherfucker is my baby. Because you're through. You took a curve. They call it all wrong, too. You ain't nothing but a dope fiend. Now, she's the dope fiend. After you drank yourself in the house in the first place. <laughs> you mean they were tweeting? Yeah. That's the thing at all. They sit up there and hide their lives on cocaine. That woman, she loved that man with a hungry dog. Deborah ain't no stupid woman, y'all. I'm a college student, Deborah. Deborah went to Berkeley. She got a degree. They was happy. They was living good until they started messing with that shit. Mm-mm. Y'all don't want to do no job. They don't need it. I'm making sure that's my kids. Don't look down at She's our mama. She's your lover. That woman's the woman who's the one who's having your child. I am her best teacher. Dictionary, get, get with the hardest deal for the planet, okay? Mm-hmm. Look at it, 
They kicked him off because apparently some two young white women had complained that a black man was looking in the window of their farmhouse, their bedroom, on this dark, lonely road. And my grandfather being the only black man walking this road at one o'clock in the morning, coming home from his job and his racing, they pick him up. And they tell him that if he fears for his life, he will leave the state of Georgia right then and there. No, he didn't get to say goodbye to his wife and his three children. So my mother and her family had to do as best they could. Daddy was, Daddy was gone. Now, it's a beautiful day. It's all about my Aunt Willie Mae, who's about 15. And she's walking through the tiny woods. She's on her way to Miss Cannon's house. Miss Cannon, whose family still owns my mother's family in the Clintons, the Cannon Plantation. But Aunt Willie is walking through the forest. She's singing, look like we're in for a fine spell of weather. Things don't go by, and we're still together. Oh, who can see them coming all the way? I know you forever. She arrives at Miss Cannon's house. Good morning, Miss Cannon. Now she's petulant, you know, because she's 15. She does these out doing something else and ironing some white lady's laundry, all right? So she's getting herself together, right? She's got the ironing board, and there's the two bushels of clothes, and she's um, happy sometimes enters Miss Cannon. With a maid, I've been so disappointed in you. You have got to clean the bathroom again and right. And how am I supposed to have my spring car this week? Yes, ma'am. And you're going to have to do all the windows again. They are just a mess. Yes, ma'am. And then you got to go in the kitchen and you got to clean up mom. Mama doesn't have a breakfast, you know, she always makes a mess. Then you got to clean up the kitchen. Then you got to set mom on the porch after you clean her up, too. Miss Cannon! Miss Cannon, I got two bushels of clothes this week. I, 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 I can't do all this work by myself. I don't feel good. I'm going home. And she did. <laughs> so she goes home. Pretty soon, Mr. Cannon and his boys.
for some rusty, dusty colored gal to be out here naked in front of all you good white men. So. Dr. Bland worked with my daughter on the day to do by my little And my daughter brought this to my teacher. She said, Mom, this girl was giving a hell in my. She was reminding me of Raleigh that they was at things too. She said, Why can't they call you sad niggas? And somebody told her, Your mouth. Your mouth is a hell of a lot. God bless her soul. God bless her soul. Before I go, I just wanted to, I work with women for a long time. I work with women now for 35 years. And I just want us to, uh, to call up the names of women that we have been denied. Women that disappeared as a way to bring them in more closely to this conversation. My aunt really made herself poison. Let me y'all. Another woman. Mary West. Mary West. Another woman. Fanny Another woman. 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 A feminist prayer goes like this. Judy Grind wrote this, but, but we're going to use it tonight. It is, oh, our mother who art in heaven, sister shall be thy name. Sister shall be thy name. Our washing's done. Our washing's done. Our kitchen's clean. Our kitchen's clean. And it is in heaven. And it is in heaven. Give us this day our disparagements. Give us this day our disparagements. As we forgive those who disparage against us. As we forgive those who disparage against us. And lead us not into home economics. And lead us not into home economics. But deliver us. But deliver us. Into politics. Into politics. For there is the money. For there is the money.
Catharsis. Notice how your breathing is changing. And keep going. 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 Keep going.
in it still. Michael Stewart. Maya Hall. Yvette Smith. Trayvon Martin. Miriam Perry. Natasha McKenna, Kendra James, Renisha McBride, Tamir Rice, Sean Bell, Amadou Diallo, Kendrick McDade, Eleanor Bumpers, Sharice Francis, Oscar Grant, Ayanna Jones, Timothy Russell, Latanya Haggerty, Margaret Laverne Mitchell, Taisha Miller, Jordan Davis. Chantel Davis, Jonathan Barrow, Katherine Johnston, Darnisha Harris, John Crawford III. Akai Gurley. Jermaine Bean. Charles Eimers, Glenn Ford, Kendra Chapman, Eric Gurman, Freddie Gray, Sandra Bland.
this place, for we have glanced more times than we'd like to share into eyes that stare with nothing there behind them but an unfulfilled wish and an unconscious yearning for life, though death rests comfortably beside us at night, their moans are louder. They come to visit the guards at the gate and they stay until morning, torturing their guilt-ridden insides. The silent cries of the keepers are louder than the booms that come from the guns they use to occupy the space. And we know this place. For we have seen more times than we'd like to imagine. Bloated cadavers floating through waters of a city gone savage, foraging the land for what can be salvaged, but what can be saved when all is lost? It happened in August, 29 days in. We are now five days out of the only place we knew to call house and home. Few things are certain. One, 
we have no food. Two, there are more bodies lying at the roadside than hot plates being distributed, or first aid being administered, or recognition as a citizen, 14th Amendment, and refugee. Check. We know this place. It's ever-changing, yet forever the same. Money and power and greed that gain, they suck and devour the souls of the slain. Oh, what a feast for the beast at their table of shame. With napkins round necks to catch the blood that drains from the flesh they chew. Oh, it's hell to gain, and we know this place. I'm all too well, dank with the smell of death and doom. It smothers, it hovers, no growth, no doom, no pretty, no peace. Just gray, just blue, just born me a hope, and it died too soon. Just jumping, just jiving, just living. Oh, we just fools, and we know this place is decked in all its array and splendor. Golden streets with good intentions capture our attention. Their gadgets and inventions pesticide the food supplies. Like symptoms, diabetic condition, a cancer in the system, health on hold. It's a pistol to the temple. Go run to your churches. Tell Ram this simple. Good works and good deeds is what equals redemption. But tell me, please, Jesus never mentioned how the churchmen get extensions on freedom while children are being fondled from the altar to the streets, then back to the sanctuaries. Oh, it's kind of scary, ain't it? To know that both the prophet and and the priests practice deceit. Then come to the people and claim peace, peace. They come to the people and claim love, love. But where is the peace, huh? Where is the love? Where is that balm in Gilead that can heal the wounded soul or make a half man whole? I swear, we know this place because we have vowed before never again to return. But oh, here we are. Yes. Back in the desert, dry mouth and thirsting for waters from heaven, but come, come children, rally round, and maybe together we can make a sound that'll shake the trees, or rattle the ground, make strong our knees, we the freedom bound, and we know this place, huh? we claim the crown, hold on to the prize, never put it down, be firm in the stands, no breaks, no bow, gotta forward all mambas, make your
great evening. We hope that you guys will join us in the lobby for some light refreshments right over inside the cafe and for a couple of drinks. Maybe you can get a chance to talk to some of the dancers. Thank you so much for coming this evening. Woo